Hello and welcome to another Point Blank tutorial. In this video, our instructor Ben Medcalf shows us how to use the vintage instruments inside Logic's Pro X. Logic has for a while now provided an excellent group of modelled vintage instruments, their imitations of classic keyboards. This collection has been expanded upon somewhat in the 10.4 update and will certainly add a splash of vintage authenticity to any composition. The collection includes Mellotron Previously only available as an EXS24 instrument bank, the 10.4 update provides the Mellotron as a standalone virtual instrument. The Mellotron was an early tape-based sampler that created sound by running magnetic tape across a head and has been used over the years by many artists from David Bowie and Paul McCartney to Radiohead and approximated more recently by MGMT. The vintage Mellotron Virtual Instrument has a fairly simple interface with 10 preset sounds to choose from. Two sounds can be run in tandem and blended to taste with the mix control. The timbre of the voices can be changed using the tape speed or the tone both of which will affect the brightness and warmth of the sound. Standard transposition settings are also available for each of the two voices. The Vintage B organ is an excellent emulation of the classic Hammond organ. The Hammond works by effectively mixing a combination of harmonics together to create a composite sound. The harmonics are created by these draw bars, which can be set to the same or differing pitches. The more draw bars are pushed to the top, the thinner the sound will be. With all of them open, the fuller the sound will be. It's worth taking some time to get to know the sound of the individual draw bars here. The B3 also has a dedicated effects bank with its own distortion and reverb, amongst other things. And of course, the classic Leslie cabinet, which gives the Hammond its distinctive sound. There are actually many controls and a fair bit more to know about this very complex instrument but as is often the case the best approach is to get in there have a play around and explore for yourselves the clavinet is modeled on the vintage d6 clavinet the sound is manipulated with a group of rocker switches that effectively act like a series of bandpass filters that can be activated or deactivated to manipulate the sound other controls include setting the position of the pickup and a host of sound bending parameters involving pitch, string behaviour and articulation detail as well as some inboard effects such as distortion. The Vintage Piano is another great emulation with a simple and intuitive control interface. With it you can recreate the sound of classic electric pianos such as the Wurlitzer or the Suitcase amongst many others. As stated, the interface is pretty simple and browsing through the different preset types is probably the best way to find the right sound for your project as each effectively gives you a totally different instrument.
Aside from standard effects such as drive and tone, chorus and so on, further adjustments can be made to timbre and tonality with the various effect switches on the interface. Thank you guys for watching. This video was taken from our online course for Intro to Production Logic Pro. If you want to find out more about these courses, check out pointblankmusicschool.com. And as usual, hit that subscribe button. See you guys next time.